Hi, I'm Dr. Julie Steinauer. Today I want to talk to you about traumatic brain injury because March is Traumatic Brain Injury Awareness Month. Now, before I do that, let's talk about how you can connect with us. If you're local, call us at 618-288-1489. If you're not local, you can go to our website, visionforlifeworks.com, and you can either click on the questionnaire or you can fill out, uh, fill out a questionnaire or you can click on the schedule a consultation button. Now, let's talk about traumatic brain injury. A uh, traumatic brain injury occurs anytime that there is a blow or hit to the head, whether there's been a concussion, a slip, a fall, maybe a car accident where there's been something like a whiplash incident, or if you've had a neurological event like a stroke. Those would all, um, you know, be defined as a traumatic brain injury. So what are the symptoms that happen to an individual after a, after a traumatic brain injury? Well, this list is not meant to be all-inclusive. There is There are quite a few different things that could happen to someone after they've had a TBI. Um, blurred vision, double vision, problems with memory or sitting still and focusing and attending to detail, trouble with comprehension, reading, perhaps even a visual field loss, um, or areas of the visual field that seem like they're missing or blurry or spotty. Um, other things would be uh, headaches, light sensitivity, sensitivity to sensory information like sensory overload. For instance, going to a grocery store or you know, a kid's event at a school where there's a lot of people, there's lots of noise, there's lots of um, things going on, lots of movement, lots of light. All of those things can be bothersome to someone after they've had a traumatic brain injury. In fact, sometimes just motion in general can be problematic for someone who's had a traumatic brain injury. So in Again, March is Traumatic Brain Injury Awareness Month, so we want you to be aware of some of those symptoms. We also want you to be aware that there is something that you can do to help. If you have suffered from a traumatic brain injury, even if it's been you know, six months or two months or 10 years after that initial trauma and you still seem to have issues associated with that that are visual issues, then give us a call or contact us. Um, it is well known that many times people won't even start experiencing symptoms after the initial insult. If it's not that severe of an insult, they might not have them you know, show up for a couple of months down the road and then suddenly they're starting to have problems with light sensitivity or sounds or they just can't stay focused to concentrate on what they're trying to do. You know, sometimes these things pop up a couple months down the road and they can also last for a long time, way past the time that your doctor's telling you, you know, you should technically be healed um, from maybe that call, that concussion or that whiplash injury. So many times these things can last for years and years and they can build and they can be kind of debilitating to deal with those symptoms. So again, if that's you and you're local, give us a call at 618-288-1489. If you're not local, go to our website visionforlifeworks.com and you have two options. You can fill out a questionnaire which will give you some feedback as far as how your symptoms might be affecting you and whether or not it's serious and you need to move forward with some form of treatment. Um, or you can click on the schedule a consultation. Maybe you've been following me for a while, maybe you've watched a bunch of my videos and you know it's just time that you reached out to us. Schedule a consultation and we'll talk with you about how we can help you. Uh, obviously, if you haven't done so already and you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe so that you get all notifications for our videos. And definitely pass this on if you know someone, maybe it's not you, maybe it's not in your immediate family, but it happens to be a sibling or a friend, or maybe it's even just an acquaintance that you know who had a traumatic brain injury and is having a lot of visual problems. Please pass this video along. There is help. Uh, what we do is kind of multifold um, in that we use syntonics, which we talk about in a lot of other videos in order to help our patients, coupled with a vision therapy program that reprograms how the brain is processing visual information. And again, whether it's been a couple of months, weeks, or a couple of years after a traumatic brain injury, there are things that we can do to help alleviate the symptoms that you have and help you get back to a little bit more of a normal functioning life. Thank you.